Hey everybody and welcome to my channel Jewelry Pirate. This is Barbara. I'm coming on to do another video for you and this is going to be a pretty short one. Just a few items um, that I uh, thought you might be interested in. And um, first I wanted to show you some of my art pieces that I have. And um, these are also available if you're anyway, in any near we're being interested in um, and a piece of art for a gift for somebody. Um, these are all done by me. I don't look, some of you have gotten my card. If you're new and you haven't gotten an order from me, you'll all be getting one. Um, I am a certified uh, Grumbacher art instructor and um, I've got a lot of paintings here and they're good for gifts. This is um, I think this is a 12 by 16. Um, but anyway, there's a nice little winter scene. Um, if anybody's interested in, in any of these paintings, just let me know. Um, they're reasonable for original works of art. Um, if you want them framed, there'd be much more. I would suggest that if you see something that you really like, um, you get it framed like, you know, where where you live because it would be much cheaper um for for you to do that rather than me go and get the frame and have it framed and then add the price on so it would be much better because you might be able to find a frame in your local thrift shop that would work so we have this one this is a beautiful like i said winter scene if you're into still lifes i have this here okay which is a couple of apples i love doing still lifes this is one of the things that i'm known for if you've gotten the cards you saw the pears on there and uh this is one of those you can see my name is on there um i haven't been able to teach recently because of the covid so uh anyway this is just a nice little study with a couple of um apples and the last one I have to show you today is um, a bigger one. This is an 11 by 14. And this is a picture of Tybee Lighthouse. Um, now, Tybee Lighthouse has a lot of buildings around it. But this is this was a picture that was taken um, in, uh, in, in, in like dusk. And um, it was taken from down... Um, on the beach. The beach goes down. So at that point you cannot see um, those buildings which are going to sit up here because the building is much um, this is kind of hard because this is a bigger painting but this was um, one of the ones. So this is also available. This is in Georgia. Um, sort of kind of hard to give you a good this is this is actually a really nice painting. It's popular okay and uh remember if the buildings would be um above this okay so anyway that's uh three paintings i wanted to show you and um i have plenty of paintings i might have something that you might be interested in and like i said they're all original works of art they're um acrylics and uh they've all been done and signed by me Okay, let's get through this jewelry really fast. And um, again, thumbs up. Share if you can. Um, don't forget, if you're watching for the first time, please subscribe. And also don't forget to hit the bell to be notified when I upload a new video. If you want to claim something, timestamp and a brief description, send to my email, which is in the description box below the video. All right let's go all right um i have a really nice bangle this here is basically a small to a medium this is a heavy bangle i don't know if it's brass or not i didn't check it it is not magnetic this is gorgeous um, nice blue stones on here nice pattern really really pretty all right we'll put that there and um, I have this. Now this is um, a scarf clip or 
a piece that you would use to 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 torsad a necklace okay it opens up you have a clip on the end here and you open this up and you can put this on a really pretty necklace to make a focal point you can also twist your necklaces and use this to um put the, the two the two sides of the necklaces together and use it as um, a, a, um, an accent point on your necklace so this is made out of some kind of stone there is a small crack here but it doesn't go through the whole piece as far as I can tell it's old it's beautiful it's in the shape of a rose and um, very different than most of the ones that you normally see all right so we have that I have a very pretty little necklace here okay this is um, done in brass tones I'm gonna hold this up I'm trying to do a fast video here this is absolutely beautiful this is a Rolo chain this is silver tone and these are the brass tone all right it's a nice heavy necklace um, it's got a lobster claw clasp there is no extender on this measurement wise let me give you um, a measurement real fast this is 17 inches from the clasp down to here so this is going to sit on your collarbone that is a very very pretty necklace okay I know I have an acrylic statement piece which is really nice it's brand new still has the tags on it it is gorgeous I don't know who the manufacturer is um, let me put this together so I can put it on on Bertha for you hang on here all right this has a drop let's see here this is so pretty um, this is 15 inches all right it has a four inch extender this is absolutely beautiful this is the way it's going to look on your neck let me see here if I can show you this better this is a very um, pretty um, red and it has um, there's lots of these things on here and it just weighs so beautiful here's the back so you can see how it's all put together all right and here's the front all right this is beautiful absolutely beautiful it's not um heavy heavy but it is not a lightweight necklace like it looks looks to be all right so we have that pretty necklace Ooh. One of those days. Now this is an old necklace. This is really pretty. Um, I just love the way that this is the uh, way this is put together. And this is 22 inches. This is black and white. This is absolutely beautiful. Um, I think they're acrylic, but the way that they're put in here, the way that they're strung and they're on it they're on a, a thread all right and it's in excellent condition this is beautiful and there's your spring ring clasp um, I don't see any name on the tag um, you can see partial remnants of the tags that had the price on it at one point so it's actually a new piece this is beautiful all right really really beautiful all right so we have that pretty necklace and let's see what do we have next let's do this this is very delicate very pretty it has a barrel clasp let's see the measurement on this this is basically 24 inches this is really what we got here it's a combination of oranges and whites there are little flowers in these glass beads and these stations it is very pretty this is the bottom of your necklace give you a little idea on Bertha there 
Let me see if I can bring this up closer. This is this is very nice. These are tubes, and I'm not sure, but I think these are glass also. Very very pretty necklace. It's older. I would say it's probably from the late 70s. I'm going by the style of the beads that I see on here. So very pretty little necklace. We have that. I have this green necklace if you like bright lime green this is really pretty it's been in the bag so it's a little little wonky but it's real pretty all right I'll show you here all right this got the strand but it's got beads once you bring this all together it hangs down really nice this is a beautiful necklace and measurement on this let me put this where this has about an inch extender on it and i'll give you down to the shortest one it's 18 inches and then each strand of this gets a little bit longer a little bit longer all right it's all got to be put you know good and once you put these in the bag i mean i try to roll them up really nice but they get a little wonky, so you just got to work with them. But this is a very pretty necklace. All right. We have that one. I'm going to try to straighten that out a little bit more. And I have a mother of pearl necklace. Chip necklace. Very, very heavy. Very pretty. All right. And the measurement on this. 12 and it's about 34 inches very pretty nicely done they're not rough okay very very pretty there's some pinks in here a little bit of this and a little bit of that very very nice natural all natural mother of pearl all right, we got a really big necklace, and this I love. This is one of my favorite pieces. All right, let me get this and get a measurement for you. I just love this necklace. All right, the drop on this. Uh, this is 17 inches. This is beautiful. I don't know if you can see this real well. See if I can put this. No, it's not going to give me give me a good light here. These are all interlocking, many chains bringing all that together. Put together, absolutely beautiful. Um, one and a half inch extender. Just an all around nice necklace. Let me give you a closer look at this so you can see how beautiful this necklace is. This is definitely a statement piece. Great condition. I just love the, the way that this was put together. Nice big bead at the end of the extender. So you can get this a little bit a little bit bigger than what it is. Very, very beautiful necklace. Only got a couple more. And now I have a nice all glass necklace with a matching pair of earrings. This is very pretty. All right. Let me get this together and give you a measurement. This is all glass. This is 18 inches, not counting the pendant. It's black and white. Um, it's very, very pretty. These are all crackle glass beads. All right, and then it has a pair of earrings that match. Very beautiful. And here's the earrings. 
I don't know if you can see these too good. They're like little hearts. These almost actually look like they might be sterling. I'll have to check them out closer. They're just beautiful. There you go. A lot of articulation too. Alright, so we have that set. Two more. Put this away. This is beautiful. It's got weight on it. It's got a great clasp. And I don't see no markings on that, but you might be getting a bargain on this. Those earrings look too too much like sterling silver to me. Oh, we've got to put them back in the bag. And the last two pieces are older pieces. I have this, which is lovely. And um, let me put this on here so you can see it. There you go. This is gold tone. It's a real gold tone. It doesn't look that way with the lighting I have here. It's very hard to get the lights just the right way. It has a fold over clasp in the back. It's an excellent, excellent shape. Measurement wise. Um, 18 inches. Here's what it looks like. Very pretty. Very, very, very pretty. And these are a little, they're all in great shape. No plating issues whatsoever. And look at your class. Okay. And the last item that I have, I forget what this chain is called. Um, I don't know if it's a dragon scale or what, what it's called, but this is a heavy chain. It's not a long chain, but this is a great chain for a pendant. Um, this is 16, 17 inches. Let me show you this. This is a heavy chain. This would be great to hang a nice pendant on. I got to keep, I got to try to keep some kind of an enhancer here. Um, so that you could see, like if we put this, use this is my ring, but you could put that on there. You could see how pretty this would look with a pendant on it. Or alone, or stand alone. It's got a big, this big lobster claw clasp on it. This is gorgeous. I think this is called a dragon scale. Um, it's like a snake, but it's very, 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 very flexible. It's not something that's ever going to kink on you. Or cause you any problems and it will hold a very very substantial um, enhancer or pendant okay that's what we have that's our last item so favorites in here uh, let me get rid of Bertha oh I forgot to put this away I love this bangle and I love this bangle here, and I this is absolutely gorgeous. Um, the big silver necklace is magnificent. That one I just showed you, the gold tone one, that's an older piece. That's beautiful. If you like really natural uh, pearl, um, mother of pearl, that's great. This I love because. It is so sexy and so slinky. It just feels really good when you put it on. And old-fashioned wise, this is awesome. And everything else is wonderful. Those are just, you know, a few of the highlights of it. Even the green necklace. The green necklace for the right person, it would look wonderful on you. All right, I'm going to try to get this in the bag in one piece in good condition. And uh, I'll work on that later on to see if I can get it uh, out a little bit more. You know, a little bit of heat, too, for a blow dryer would help that. All right, so that's what I have in this lot. 
I hope you enjoyed a little preview of my artwork and a look at a few pieces of jewelry. Um, gives you some content, gives you an idea. I have so much stuff coming up. If I can ever get totally caught up with everything, you and I start firing these videos at you, um, you're, you're going to be shocked. So again, please, I appreciate each and every one of you coming in and spending time with me. You really honestly don't know how much I do appreciate that. I feel like I've got an extended family. And um, it just makes me happy. It keeps me busy. And it makes me feel like I've got some friends. So it's been very hard being stuck in the house here and not going out. And, you know, I have a couple of people that come over and visit me. And thank God for them. You know who you are. So anyway, thank you for that. I love all you guys. All right. Thumbs up, please. I really appreciate that. Share if you can, if you have friends that like jewelry. Also, if you're new and never saw any of my videos before, please subscribe. And then you can get registered by the information underneath the video. And don't forget the bell. Hit that bell just in case you want to be notified when I op um, upload a new video. Okay, I'm going to stop blabbing. I hope you all have a wonderful day. Remember... Stay safe, stay healthy, stay happy, and I love all you guys again, and bye-bye for now.